The Berlin Reichschancellery, Spring 1933. The old Ratzivil Palais, once saved by Bismarck from being demolished, then turned into the Reichschancellor's Palais, has a new occupant, Adolf Hitler. The National Socialist government claims to desire peace for the German people, but this is only a front. Hitler is planning a war, and he begins to prepare his Berlin residence. In 1935, he orders the construction of an air raid shelter. The shelter is built underneath a reception hall where Hitler can receive foreign diplomats. But none of Hitler's guests can guess that underneath the dance floor lies the bunker where only a few years later Goebbels and his wife will poison their six children. Many of the facts we know today are unthinkable to those living in the chancellery. Who could guess? As a service passage is constructed for staff, connecting the new and the old Reich's chancellery, that this passage would become a lifeline for the German leaders trapped in the Führerbunker during the final days of the Battle of Berlin. But the war Hitler began returns to its point of origin. From 1943, Hitler has to run time and again from his office in the new Reich's chancellery to try to reach the bunker in time. Now he also has to bear the fear he meted out to the European people. Will the bunker protect him from the coming firestorm? <laughs>